Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome back to my channel. So, before we get into this video, just real quick, make sure you press the subscribe button, make sure you also click that notification bell. I found out the other day that 14,000 of 100,000 people have clicked it, so make sure you go click it, it's really important. Anyway, I'm gonna stop rambling on. My name is Byron, if you're new here, welcome back to my channel. Now, I don't normally do these videos, I never really do food related videos. However, a couple months ago, probably like one month ago actually, I made a video where I lived for 24 hours off only McDonald's milkshakes. Now, that video gave me severe diarrhea as much as I hate to admit it, it just wasn't cute. It really wasn't cute. This time, another food challenge, but I'm not hopefully gonna make myself shit everywhere. I am gonna be eating for the next 24 hours only food that are starting with the letters of my name. So how this is gonna work, obviously my name is Byron. We have B, we have Y, we have R, we have O, we have N. Five letters. My name's five letters. Wow, I just did that all in my head real fast. I am a mathematical genius. <laughs> I figured out if I have breakfast beginning with B, so I've got to eat a food beginning with B, and then I have a snack between my breakfast and my lunch beginning with Y, and then I have my lunch being R, I can have another snack before my evening meal as O, and then N can be like my final meal. I have no idea what the hell I'm gonna eat throughout the duration of this video because I've not really planned that far ahead. I'm gonna skip back to the morning where I made myself breakfast, and then we're gonna continue with the day, so hopefully this goes well. Smash a big thumbs up if you wanna see more content like this, like I said at the beginning. Good luck, Charlie. Let's get in with the video. I don't know if anyone's ever done this before, but right now I'm feeling really original, so if they have done it before... Don't tell me in the comments because I want to feel like I'm doing something original, you know? Hashtag YouTuber lie. everyone, so for breakfast this morning I need to eat something beginning with the letter B and my cupboards are looking really really bare. Let's just say I haven't been food shopping in a little while, I'm gonna go food shopping later on. But right now I have literally nothing in my cupboards. The only thing that I can see that starts with B is this pack of beans. So it looks like we're having beans for breakfast. I would normally like have toast. Let's see if we've got bread. I was gonna say I would normally have toast but I can't even toast a toast because then it becomes toast and not bread. Looks like we're just having a can of beans. I don't know if this is too healthy for you just to eat a can of beans for breakfast, but we're gonna do it anyway. So I've literally no food in my cupboard. Ooh, so far, so good. Oh. Um, so my plant died. I have responsibilities. I have a plant to look after. The last leaf dropped. I think I actually overwatered it and drowned at the roots. But we're gonna move on from that because. Rich nigga, A figure, that's my type. Mm. Did someone say gourmet? I don't understand how there's so much sauce in there and then so little beans. I'm confused, but this doesn't look like it should be just consumed on its own. But I'm gonna sit here, mukbang, and eat this. I love these sausages. I literally cannot remember the last time I had just beans on its own. Like I would love some cheese with this or like a jacket potato. But my name doesn't start with jacket potato, so cheers. I just don't know how I'm a massive fan of just beans on its own. I also didn't know if to get a fork out or a spoon because I'm literally eating beans, so I could use a spoon to do that. I went with a fork in the end, but like, do you eat beans with a fork or a spoon? I guess you're not meant to just eat beans on its own. End of, so there we are, period, stop. Oh my God, bacon and beans I could have had. Bitch. So it is now lunchtime. As you can see, I'm not in the house anymore. But as you will have also seen this morning, I literally have nothing in my cupboard or my fridge. So me and Freya are currently on the way to the shop. I need to find something that starts with Y, R, O, and N. I feel like the rest of the letters apart from Y will be really easy because I've never, I can't think of anything apart from if we cheat and do like yellow something. But then I don't know if I want to do colors. I kind of just want to do the actual name of the food or what I call it anyway. Right, the first thing I see when we come in is some rice. I know it says golden vegetable, but it's just rice. So we're going to get this for R. But I need to find something to eat with that because I can't just have rice on its own This is actually so much harder than I thought it was gonna be I'm walking around thinking why 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 as in not like why is in the letter why <laughs> but I can't find anything It's only my snack so like it doesn't really matter too much because it's a snack. It's not an actual main meal I cannot find anything right considering it's only a snack I might just go for some yogurts, but then again. I don't know if I like these I don't know if I like the milk chocolate ones right. We're just gonna go for this I feel like that were kind of cheating because it's actually food. I know it's yogurt and it starts with a Y and it is only a snack. Then I also feel like that's not like food. When I say I'm literally looking on every aisle for something, I mean like I cannot find anything in here. All right, so so far we have yogurts for Y, we have rye for R, and that's literally it. And then I've just got my normal food shop. I'm struggling so, so bad. I'm thinking an orange for O because that's more of a snack as well. I have nothing for N. I literally cannot find anything. This is so fucking hard. Literally just as I film that clip, I come to the end of the aisle 
aisle and here we have some rocky bars however I don't really think that's a meal and considering ours meant to be the meal I can't really have rice and a rocky bar <laughs> but we'll grab them anyway why not this is probably cheating but I literally can't find anything else that starts with R so we're going for Richmond sausages and rice for my lunch so that'll be fun oranges check all right so we're back from the shop now it is a little while later I've washed my hair and had a shower as you can see my hair is currently wet it's now time to eat this yogurt for the Y we're gonna strike Y off the list because here it is a yogurt I know it technically is a Miller corner which is like M and C but then I were also like but it's just a yogurt like we can't find anything else with a Y what other snack do you know for a Y if you know one please let me know but I'm gonna sit and eat this I used to have these in my lunchbox as a kid and I've not had one since actually so this is gonna be really nostalgic I hate this like what is this pre come ass shit on the thing I hate it like I'm gonna save this moment because it goes downhill from here on out, coach. So we've done the B, we've done the Y, and now it's lunchtime, and this is R. As you can see, Richmond sausages. I know you may be thinking sausages is an S. No, these are Richmond, and I'm counting it because I can't just have rice on its own. I literally couldn't find anything. I realised after I probably could have got, like, risotto. <laughs> you know, that begins with R. But I'd already bought it, and I've never had risotto, actually, so that would have been kind of fun to try. Let's get into that sausage. I mean, it's a good sausage moment. I mean, it's not bad. Like, I've literally had rice and sausages before, but you don't typically have them together as a meal, so it's just a weird concept, you know? But it's nice. It's not very flavorful. This rice is not very great. All right, so a little bit of time has passed. I now have my orange. We're on to O, so we've literally got one more meal after this, which is obviously my dinner. I'm thinking of having chicken nuggets because obviously nuggets is N, and I literally cannot find anything else. I might also order, you know, a six nugget meal from McDonald's. And I, oh! I feel like I've just eaten like I would in like primary school because I used to have a little orange in my pack lunch as well. This is really nostalgic. I'm also really like not hungry. I thought I would be hungry. I didn't really have anything but beans for my breakfast. The rice really did fill me up, so I'm not surprised, but I feel like I've done this quite healthily. Apart from I'm probably gonna have McDonald's for dinner, so like let's not jump the gun too soon. But I feel like this has been quite healthy, not gonna lie. And one day when I take to the floor, the world's gonna wake up and see. Baltimore and me. Woo! Oh. <laughs> you fucking bitch! Oh, hi. I actually don't know why my hair's like this. I look like Ned's classified school survival guide. Hi. It is currently 8.55 in the evening. Can you see that? No, you can't because it's fucking too bright. But it's 8.55 in the evening. I need to eat now. So, me and Hazard going to be cheeky and order a McDonald's. I knew I was going to do this anyway. If we just go on and um, see what they've got to offer at McDonald's. In fact, I need to get... Sorry, love. In fact, I need to... <laughs> <laughs> It's not for you, but you're a huge bitch. Has is just actually knitting over there. Like, this actual grandma is a sewing machine genius over here. So whilst Haz is actually sewing buttons into the kids' eyes, I am going to um, order some McDonald's. I've got to have a chicken nugget meal, so I don't even know why I'm looking at the menu. Because all the going around, looking around, looking around, looking around, looking around, looking around. So as you can see, we have two six chicken nugget meals on the way. We've just got to place this order. There we are. Oh, that's just my card details. <laughs> Ta-da! Time to crack this up in. This video has been so, like, good in terms of what I've eaten. But, like, finding the foods were quite difficult. Apart from breakfast. Breakfast were not that fun. This is end nuggets. Oh, you little cheats, guy. <laughs> I was thinking, how does McDonald's <laughs> come into your name? It does. Nuggets. See that? Chicken nuggets. <laughs> Cheers. I'm really curious, what sauce does everyone get from McDonald's? Say if you got a six nugget meal, what sauce do you get with that? Or do you just eat them dry? Like I went through a stage where I would eat them dry and then I used to always get barbecue and then I always used to get ketchup and now I'm onto sweet and sour and I have been for probably like two years now. But I don't have this sauce with absolutely like, anything else. I'm definitely a sweet and sour type of guy. And just like that, we're back here again. I um, forgot to film an outro, so it actually went really well. Like, I'm shocked as how well it went because when we were literally looking around the supermarket earlier on in the video, I was having real doubts. I was like, I should have planned this beforehand. I literally woke up, decided I was going to do it, headed to the supermarket with nothing in mind, and then came back and was like, shit, I could have had like bacon for breakfast if I've planned this properly. But here I was, sat eating a tub of beans. So I'm feeling relatively good. I don't feel like I ate much yesterday purely because I was really restricting myself to what I could eat. However, I found it really interesting because I managed to do it. I did kind of cheat with the McDonald's, however they are nugget. They're like kinda. I just wanted an excuse to have McDonald's, okay? Anastasia King's love, I'm coming for your branding. 
Anyway, yeah, like I said, that is it for this video. If you did enjoy, smash a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, tell your friends, do all that fun stuff. And if you want to see more videos like this, then let me know in the comments. Let me know, actually, if you do this. I'm really curious to see that like, even if you don't do YouTube and want to do it, try and do it for a day. It's a lot more difficult than you think, but also, I don't know how it'd work if you had a longer name. Maybe you'd have to combine letters. Like, I were really tempted to do R and O together and get, like, orange chicken and rice. However, I thought, you know what, I'm going to have two snacks. I'm going to be greedy. I'm going to do that to myself. So, yeah, let me know if you try this. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you like this style of video i'm really just trying to experiment a lot with my channel so let me know what you think like i just said i love you a lot and i'll chat to you in a few days time with a brand new video i'm super original subscribe bye